Hi, I'm Dean Argent, a university qualified mechanical engineer, and I'm the owner of usedvehiclesales.imgettingwet.com.au. And in this video, I'm going to take you on a walkthrough of this uh, 2004 Toyota, Toyota Prado 7 seat automatic 4x4. Oh, it's on. That I've got for sale here. Oh, on my yard. I don't know why they do this, but as soon as I start recording these videos, they come out and they start, and I worry I'm going to get knocked over. So. <laughs> And I'm recording for an iPhone, which means you can't pause. So I hope I don't get belted too hard. So anyway, back to the story. What I want to tell you, when I choose these cars, and this one exceptional, uh, ticked all these boxes exceptionally, first thing I want to look for is, um, have a look down here, see how well the tyres are wearing evenly across the surfaces, especially the steer tyres. Tells me all the suspension geometry, steering componentry, and all that's working nicely. I can tell there's a, a um, dash mat, the side step, the roof racks, the Toyota bull bar, and it's the GXL. So when I see all those things on the car, plus it's also got the Toyota, one of these, and that tells me straight away that the previous owner, or the purchaser, whoever that was, they've uh, bought all the genuine aftermarket stuff for their car. Oi, oi, you two, stop it, I'm busy. <laughs> they've bought all the genuine aftermarket stuff for their car. They are car lovers, right? They're not car abusers, you can tell. Have a look down the side here. For a car of this age with these kilometres, not a single dent. Look down this side, not a single dent. I seriously doubt this car's ever been off-road. But there are a few little things like, you know, a little few little paint chips missing there. Get back here, you can't even see them. And there we go. So as we walk around, let's have a look. I'll show you some of the features. It's got the alloy wheels, the GXL, the Toyota side steps, the shiny mirrors with the dude giving thumbs up in the back tinted windows let's have a look inside the um gives me <laughs> the uh got the power windows and it, like i said the seven seat automatic this is a family car i can tell because it's got the drop down video player up there so let's have a look in here Oop. the car's just in beautiful condition so i've been driving it for a little while lovely better turn this down so there's the dash and all that. It's got the 90 litre fuel tank over there, which is a cool feature. And cruise control, of course. These Toyotas are fair dink and they're just bulletproof. Now it's got the second start down there. You see that in there? I'll try and zoom in on it a bit more. There, second start. I haven't got a friggin' clue what it does, but we've got it in there. So here's the dash mat that I was talking about. But have a look right around the condition of the car. It's just in beautiful condition. You wouldn't know that it's got those kilometres on it and you wouldn't care either because these cars... Like, look at this. When you see cars with, the, with uh, lots of kilometres on them, they normally get wear marks, hectic wear marks in this area, in this area of the seat. This one's as new. So, um, let's have a look in here. We can see we've got in the back seat there. All this folds down and... Uh, you just want to pull on that and it comes down like that but I'm not going to do it in this video because it needs two hands and I've only got one and I can't pause the phone so the seats also recline so you can see how I've pushed that seat back so if you're sitting in here and you're in the back on a road trip you can have some fun you can drop this thing down here rest up on there and let the party happen so or you could watch I don't know, movies up there. All the kids, if they were like my kids, what they'd do is just fight over which video they get to watch. And down here, this thing here is something to do with plugging in to that up there. Now, I haven't tested this. I don't know if it works. Um, so just keep that in mind. As we come around the back here, you can see the overall condition. I said that the roof rack's up the top there. Jeez, it's hard to focus in this weather. Let's have a look in the back. So it's got the um, wheel cover. Because this is the GXL, uh, which stands for, what does it stand for? Glorious Extra Luxury. Because it's the Glorious Extra Luxury model, it's got the uh, wheel cover on there. Some of the uh, lower spec ones don't have that. Got the tow bar for towing those big loads and stuff. Got the seven seats in the back, which normally fold up <coughs> up here like that. And then they latch on up there and then these feet come down like that and then they latch into there and then the kids can sit in the back 
So the kids can fight over those few things there. Put their drinks in that. Open up that thing that they shouldn't do. Got a little thing over there for putting stuff they can hide. See, I know what my kids would do. They'd take the, their, the boys would take their sister's iPad or something and hide it in there and go, oh, I don't know what happened to it. But you can put the, um, the fridge in there. See that one where the, the plug? You can put your fridge in the back if you lift these seats up. Or you can even actually take the seats out. That's what I was showing you here. That, that red thing's pretty easy just to bang. Seats come out. If you've got baby seats, you can plug them onto there. Which is again another cool feature. The door locks here. So if you just unlock that so I can close it again. And if the kids want to jump out the back, they can tug on that handle to do it. Pretty cool. Lovely. So, got the back windows, they pop out. They're what's called the flipper windows. So if you just um, open up back here, if they want to, they can just flip the window out. Like, ooh, just got one by the door, like that. So, they can get a bit of air in there. Have a look at this. If you can see those lines on there, that's actually the aerial for the car. If you have a look, there's no aerial. So that's pretty cool, eh? So they've got the aerial tucked in there on the back windows. So don't break these windows, they're expensive. So have a look in here on this side. You can see all that stuff that we looked at before. Here you've got the power windows and all that. It's just a nice car. Just a nice car. See over there, got the um, service books and all that stuff in there. So there you have this Toyota Land Cruiser Prado seven seat automatic that I've got for sale here on my yard. So when the cars come into the yard, I spend a lot of time preparing them properly. So what I do is when they first come in, we road test them all and I'm listening with my finely tuned ears, having a listen for things like, you know, noises that shouldn't be there. And so then I start writing a list. Then it goes over to Nathan, our yard manager. He gets through and goes on the inside of the car and double checks everything's working inside like it should. And then we take him up on the hoist in the raised roof back there into the workshop. And the roadworthy guy comes out, goes underneath all the suspension and all that other stuff. And now we've got a list of what we need to do to meet the standard that these cars have to go out at. And that is with everything working. If something's not working, I'll tell you. Or if I don't know, I'll tell you. Like we say with that drop down thing. Just because I didn't have a DVD to test it, there's every chance it'll work. So, um, so there's that. So the cars all meet my 140 point safety check before they go out. So this one was no exception. It drives beautifully, everything's good. Safety and reliability are assured because I've done all those things. Now, as you can see, we're on dirt, right? And I'm here on a Saturday afternoon in the rain recording these videos because what I do, we do it completely different. I don't have concrete, I don't have flags, I don't have salesmen ready to swoop on you. I record on these videos like this. I put all my effort into the cars. So I've got a full mechanical workshop there and a full-time mechanic, full-time yard manager. We make sure they all meet a very specific standard. Now, what that means for you is go and have a look on my Facebook page. You'll see that as of recording this video, Zero is how many bad reviews I've ever had and we sell lots and lots of cars on Facebook And if you know anything about Facebook, you know that bad news travels really really fast So I am very proud of the cars that leave here So you don't have to be worried about the condition mechanically because we recondition them bring them up to a very specific level Otherwise, they don't leave the yard if the cars can't be made to meet the yard Off to an auction That's why you shouldn't buy cars from auctions because that's where blokes like me dump stuff that's too hard to fix so this Prado, no problem whatsoever. So everything's working fine. You're not going to find anything not working. It, just beautiful top to bottom. There's my sales pitch. How do I go? <laughs> so that's about as salesy as it gets here, by the way. So now what I want to tell you is what comes with the car for the price you see it advertised for. Um, oh, the other thing with that too is uh, when, you, when you come down, like with these videos, I do all this so you can see all the condition of the car. Uh, people sometimes ask, is your price negotiable? No, my prices are fixed. So what we do is we fix the price and I include about, in this one, probably around about $1,500 worth of extras that you're gonna see included. Um, and I'm gonna cover those off right about now. Are you ready? So here's all the stuff you get with the car, right? Um, firstly, it comes with all the fees and charges, government fees and charges, stamp duties, all that already included. Comes with, freshly serviced so when we do all that um, the inspections we also service the vehicles as well and then that means you won't need to do any scheduled maintenance for the next 10,000 k's or the next six months whichever comes first 
It comes with guaranteed no money owing, guaranteed never been written off. I'll show you all that on the paperwork when you come out. Come out. Uh, it's got um, a roadworthy certificate. It's got rego out till whatever the date says. If you're an interstate buyer, give me a call and I'll let you know how we handle the uh, non-Queensland rego because we'd move lots of cars into New South Wales as well, which is no trouble. We've got a way around all that. If you need help with your finance, I did leave something out. What was it? Ah, oh, the 12 months roadside assist. So if you've got, uh, if you, I put these roadside assist policies on it. So if you get a breakdown, run out of fuel, flat tire, flat battery, something like that, you got a number to call to get you out of trouble. So if you need help with your finance, there is a link at the top of the page. It says no deposit finance. You can get up there and have a look. If you, uh, if you don't need help with your finance, that's fine. You want to come down and buy it better give us a ring and make a time to come down and have a look because as you can see the yard's always closed because of the dogs um, so we only open up by appointment which is cool you just let us know when you come and we'll make sure someone's here well there you have it that should be pretty much everything i'm dean argent thanks for watching this video if i've left something out or you want to know more feel free to sms me or if you just want to come down and get it that's fine we can move cars all over australia if you need it transported let us know we can get your quote thanks for watching this video and i look forward to meeting with you soon. See ya.